President Tsai Ing-wen delivered her traditional New Year's address yesterday morning from the presidential office. Tsai used the speech to urge Taiwanese to stand behind what she termed the four understandings. These are four understandings about the Chinese government and the actions it is taking against Taiwan. Tsai said that if all of Taiwan's citizens and political parties could unite behind the four understandings, Taiwan could be better positioned to face external threats and stand tall in the international community. On the first day of 2020, President Tsai gave the traditional New Year's speech. Last year, she proposed the four musts. This year, she focused on the four understandings. A year later, my convictions are even stronger. A few days ago, I proposed four understandings. First, China is the one undermining the status quo in the Taiwan Strait, not Taiwan. Second, China is using the 1992 consensus to undermine the Republic of China. Third, sovereignty cannot be exchanged for short-term economic benefits. Fourth, we must be aware that China is infiltrating all facets of Taiwanese society to sow division. We have clearly told the world that Taiwan will never accept one country, two systems. Tsai reiterated that Taiwan would never accept the one country, two systems framework. She also used the speech to announce her four-year plan for creating another economic miracle. We will realize trillions of dollars in investments, turning Taiwan into a high-end manufacturing center, high-tech R&D center, green energy development center, regional capital and wealth management center, and a hub for high-tech and industrial personnel training. We will devote our efforts to economic transformation and industrial innovation to remold Taiwan amid rapid change in the global economy. Tsai also listed new policies that will take effect on New Year's Day. These include a raise to the minimum wage, childcare subsidies, and a long-term care tax deduction. She expressed thanks to Premier Su Zhenchang for his achievements over the past year.